Hi guys, we're going to be talking about a special feature of your Hangout methods called pinning. And in the past we've called this blue boxing, so I might stumble. I'll just tell you I'm human. I might mess up and call it blue boxing, because in the past this used to be a blue box, and now it's actually a white box. And because I am afraid they might change the color to be green next week, I'm going to just call it the official name, which is called pinning. Now normally, when you're inside of a Hangout, what you pin, meaning you click on one of these thumbnail things on the very bottom, what you pin is what you see. And so I'm going to give you an example of what that looks like. I have myself pinned, so that's who I see. If I pin Susan, I see her in the main window. Even though I'm still talking, she's in the main window. I can pin Michael, I can go to Debbie, and I can go to Andrew. And I can move from person to person and just highlight, in essence, or emphasize who I want to see on the main screen by pinning. Normally, you don't want that unless you just want to have control over everything because it's easier to let the conversation change who's in the main window. So let's do that. I'm going to turn off the pin the same way I turned it on by clicking on it one more time. It's a toggle that turns it on, turns it off. And now let's start just a little bit of a conversation. So, um, Andrew, how are you today? Yeah, I'm doing fine. If the speed would increase, it would help a whole lot. So if you've got a knob over there you can turn, it would help. Uh, to speed up your internet? No, I don't have that special yes. knob. Sorry. <laughs> so, Michael, Michael, I hear you're doing well, at least in your office. It's yes. a busy day. I'm doing very fine. Absolutely well right now. Okay. And so you'll note here that the picture's changing, and I'm not touching anything. My hands are right here. In fact, I'll keep my hands in the air. Debbie, say something for you, would you? Hi, you guys. Glad to be with you. And yes, it's like 100 degrees in Denver, but that's not slowing down my internet, I don't think. Okay, good. So that's like auto-magically, right, uh, Ronnie? Is that right? Yeah, it automatically changes based on sound. And this is normal. And now, what I want to do is emphasize the fact that when you pin yourself, you get to see yourself, and it's actually a good idea to do that because you get to see the visuals around you and make sure that what you're seeing is what you want to be presenting, and that's a good idea. But at times, pinning makes a big difference, and here's what I mean. If you are a, in a, you're a guest inside the Hangout, you can pin, and whatever you pin is what you see, and that's the way it works. It's fine 100% of the time. However, if you're the host and you pin, you have more control. Because when the host pins something, that person or that screen is now what the viewers see, the people on the outside. They will see what the host sees. So one way to think about this, if you are the host of the Hangout on Air, what you see on screen is what the viewers see, and it's also what's shown in the recorded video. And now why would you pin someone? Well, let's say I am needing to show how wonderful um, Susan's new... Uh, Lower third is what she put on. So I'm going to pin it right now. And hi, Susan. Hello. And I can still be talking. And you'll note that my sound is coming across, but Susan's still in the main window. So that's one reason why we might do pinning. How about someone else? Would you mind, would someone else in the film strip turn on a lower, I'm sorry, a um, comment using the comment tracker tool? Mm -hmm. Give you another example of why we might use pinning. Okay, Susan did it again. I'm going to blue, I'm going, oh, I almost said it. I'm going to pin her. So you'll see there, there's a white box around it. And now we've brought up a comment from Doug Green and we can read it and say, wow, very cool. It truly was done in 30 minutes. And, and this is kind of neat, which shows his picture. So That's this is cool. neat and this is pretty new, but it depends on when you're seeing this video as to how new this is. So I have, I am talking, but we were able to still see that comment because we were able to pin it. Now there's a little bit more fancy stuff and a little more advanced that we're going to get to in just a moment. So that's for the special folks. So right now we're going to sort of end this part of the video for now. That's how pinning works. So to see the rest of this video and other wonderful member only content, we need you to join the Hangout Mastery community where you'll not only see really valuable stuff like this, but you'll also be part of an incredibly valuable, interactive, fun community where you learn and get all your answers to your Hangouts and Hangouts on Air question with other people just like you, as well as me guiding the conversation. You're going to love it. We hope to see you there.